Robert Livingston, also known as Chancellor, was born November 27, 1746, in New York City, New York, British America. Livingston went and graduated from King's College, now Columbia University, to become a lawyer. After he graduated, he became the following, member of Provincial Congress of New York, Constitutional Congress, 1776 to 1783, Chancellor of New York, 1783, Delegate to the New York Ratifying Convention, 1788, Minister of the Court of Napoleon, 1801. In 1776, as a member of Provincial Congress of New York, he was elected to attend the Continental Congress. Robert Livingston was one of the committee to draft the Declaration of Independence, but was recalled by his state before he could sign it. Livingston was appointed Secretary of Foreign Affairs. Soon after the Article of Confederation was adopted, he served there until 1783, when he was appointed Chancellor of the State of New York. He was a lawyer for the Federal Constitution and served as a delegate to the New York Convention held at Pogs Kempsey in 1788 to ratify it. On the 30th of April, 1789, Robert Livingston administered the presidential oath of the office of George Washington in 1801. President Jefferson appointed Robert Livingston as a resident minister to the court of Napoleon. It was he who negated the Louisiana Purchase from the French. He was also a pardon of Robert Fulton, who refined the steam engine. Robert Livingston died on February 26, 1813, in Clermont.